friends, in this video I will show you how to crochet a cloth like that. So it's very easy and quick to do. With two hours you are able to do a very nice uh, sweater for your dog. She is my dog Tequila, she's 11 years old and she's very very nice and a very clever dog. Thank you, Tequila. Bye-bye. For this project, I'm using this worsted weight yarn to be worked with a 6 mm crochet hook. These are the features. This is an acrylic to be worked, in my case, with a 6 mm crochet hook. Slip note to start, like that, and now do a foundation chain so long as it fit around the neck of your dog. The chain must be long enough to fit around the neck of your dog. When your chain is ready, chain one to turn and do single crochet one in each stitch across the row like that at the end of the first row chain two and turn the first two chains take the place of the first double crochet and now double crochet one in each stitch across the row but inserting your hook into the back loop of each stitch only like that in this way do that till the end of this row okay second row is completed now chain two and turn and now you have to do double crochet in each stitch of previous round insert your hook only into the front loop of each stitch like that this is the stitch you insert your hook only into the front loop of each stitch like that this is the effect you have on the right side when you have finished the third row you have to do for the next row double crochet into the back loop then again into the front loop then back then front then back and so on till you reach the needed length for your dog when the bigger rectangle is ready now you have to do the smaller one and you have to do a foundation chain which is the half of the first one so I did for this big rectangle 32 chains at the beginning so now I have to do 16 in your case in case of your dog size you have to do a foundation chain which is the half of the one you did for the big rectangle okay when your foundation chain is ready chain one and in the second chain from the hook do single crochet in each chain across 
the row till you get the end like that from the second row chain two and turn and now start doing double crochet in each stitch across the row you have to do that for all the next rows of this piece and you have to reach more or less the length which is just one third less than the length of the big rectangle okay when also the second piece the big, the small piece is ready you have to join it into the middle of the big rectangle this is the reverse side the right side is here you join that on one side on the other side i will put instead some buttons so that it's easier to put uh, for my uh, to put the sweater to my dog so my dogs can wear easier this sweater this will be the neck and this is the bottom of the sweater of course when joining you have to leave the space for the leg on this side okay, okay. i joined my pieces together this is these are the spaces for the legs you see this is the neck now i have to do some rounds for refining so starting from this corner on the bottom of my cloth insert your hook pick up the yarn pull it through and start doing single crochet as refining all the way around so you have to go all around across the bottom then you go up here since you reach the starting point and you slip slip stitch for closing this round okay now we have to refine the area around the neck here so we start taking a new yarn from here from this corner pick up the yarn pull it through chain one and start doing single crochet all around in this way all across here this row till you reach the opposite side okay i did my single crochet all across the top of my sweater now i am at the corner into the last stitch i'm doing two single crochet so that i can turn and now continue doing single crochet also on this edge like that till i reach this point this corner down there. i did my single crochet over there on this edge and i reach the corner now i have here to do all across this row till the next corner here i have to do some decreases I start here from the first stitch with a single crochet now I'm doing two single crochet finished together again two single crochet finished together again two again two single crochet finished together and that's my way to decrease till I reach the next corner so continue doing one and two single crochet close together 
since you reach the next corner one and two this is the last one now one single crochet into the corner and go up there across this edge till you reach the first single crochet up there like that now you stop decreasing of course and you do regular normal single crochet across this edge like that like you did on the opposite side okay two single crochet the two last single crochet into the same stitch and now slip stitch to join into the first single crochet you did at the beginning of this round now start a new round of a single crochet all the way around in this way and when i am back here on this edge i will do also some loops for the bottom i have to put on the opposite side so that i can close my collar in this way close it completely now we go ahead doing single crochet one in each stitch of previous round you don't need to decrease anymore because you decreased at previous round like that now one single crochet into the corner you go up there on this edge and now we are doing our loops from here one two three chains skip one stitch into the next one single crochet one another single crochet one into the next stitch another single crochet one into the next one now again another loop made of chain three skip one stitch one single crochet second single crochet and closed with one slip stitch into the first single crochet of this round your work is finished and now you can cut the yarn you just have to put one and two buttons on the other side so that you can join uh, you can join okay them. i put the button you see now my clothes for my dog is ready this is the space for the legs now I will show you uh, this cloth word by my dog. My mm. dog's weather is ready. This is my tequila with her new cloth. So very nice. Do you like it? I hope so. Bye bye tequila. The other dog is very jealous. She would like to have his new uh, cloth as well. Bye bye.